Have the patient lay down in a comfortable place where you can easily access the drive line. You are then going to clean off the bedside table with an antimicrobial wipe. Allow to air dry. While the table is drying, wash your hands with soap and water for 30 seconds. Next, we're going to gather our products. One split gauze packet, two gauze pad packets, a bottle of Betadine, two pairs of gloves, and masks, one for yourself and one for the patient. And lastly, one roll of Metaphor tape. If you are not using masks, have the patient turn their head away from the site while performing the dressing change. Open the split gauze packet and the two gauze pad packets. Next, we are going to open the bottle of Betadine and pour a sufficient amount onto both gauze pads. Next, we're going to put on our gloves and loosen and remove the old dressing. Once the old dressing is removed, inspect the exit site for signs of infection. Discard the old dressing and remove your gloves. Next, you're going to wash or use hand sanitizer on your hands and put on clean gloves. Take one of the betadine soaked gauzes and starting at the exit site, scrub for 30 seconds using a circular motion. Go from the exit site outwards and include the drive line. Repeat with the second betadine gauze and allow to air dry completely. Scrub the exit site outward for 30 seconds in a circular motion. Tuck the split gauze under the driveline at the exit site. Cover with the remaining gauze pad. Remove your gloves and cover with metaphor tape. It's helpful at this point to write the date on the dressing. Lastly, place your Metaphor tape in a Ziploc bag for next use.